Hi everybody, my name is Sean O'Kane with Chip Estimate TV. We're here at ArmTechCon 2011 at the Santa Clara Convention Center. My guest today is Evan Upton, uh, who is uh, one of the founders of uh, this wonderful organization, Raspberry Pi. Could you tell us a little bit more about that? Okay, so the Raspberry Pi Foundation is, uh, we're based in Cambridge in the UK, uh, and we're producing a, a $25 uh, ARM Linux uh, device. It's designed to plug into your television. Uh, it's designed to uh, plug into a USB mouse and keyboard. Um, and our aim is to provide a, provide a platform that you can give to any child. Um, that's, uh, it's cheap enough that uh, it's, it's cheap enough you can equip a class with them for $1,000. And the intention is to provide these to children and give them an opportunity to learn to program, to give them an opportunity to learn to program from a very early age, which we think is uh, it's kind of important for developing good programming skills. Um, I guess this is something that came out of our work with Cambridge University, uh, trying, to, uh, trying to attract a good pool of undergraduate talent. Um, and we're really just trying to kind of, kind of build up the base of people who know how to program when they come in the door at university, rather than having to uh, spend most of the first year bringing them up to speed. Yeah, and this is great because uh, this uh, design uh, received the Best in Show award winner here at ARM TechCon which is a very, very nice recognition. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, we, I, we, I was flabbergasted. I, I was asked to turn up early. This, I was asked to turn up in time for the keynote this morning. Uh, and yeah, I was sitting there and uh, we're going to have a nice, uh, I understand we're going to have a nice chunk of, uh, of engraved glass to put on our, uh, put on our mantelpiece <laughs> at home. So. Well, Evan, why don't you take us through a, just a, a run through and a, a demo? Okay. All right. Okay. So um, as you can see here, we have a, uh, here we have the device in the back here um, running a, uh, just running a conventional Linux desktop. So you know, we try to emphasize to people that this is, this is just a PC. It, uh, it, has a different, it has a different processor inside, so it has an ARM-based processor, where maybe most of the PCs you've used have uh, x86 processors from Intel or AMD inside. Um, but it, re it really is just a, just a general purpose computer. So here we have, have it running X11, uh, running a web browser. And uh, in fact, we have our foundation's website up here. And you can see, just fairly, fairly vanilla, generic machine. Now, we really feel that one of the places that this machine stands out uh, is multimedia. I guess we can show you a yes. couple of demos of the, uh, we can show you a couple of demos of multimedia running on the device. Um, but um, I guess what we're not demoing here today is, you know, we're demoing a number of features which are uh, um, kind of relevant to the, using this device as a general purpose computer. And we've been very surprised, given our initial focus on education, we've been very surprised mm -hmm. um, that people have tended to, um, uh, a vast number of the people who got in touch with us have been interested in using this just as a general purpose computer. People really? have been interested in using this as a, um, uh, as a streaming media box, right. uh, as a, a second PC, something to plug into their television to let them surf the web on their television. Um, and so kind of quite a lot of the demos we're doing here today speak to that. Uh, we do have a number of demos of running popular educational software. Right. So things like uh, Scratch from MIT is right. a really good example of that. Maybe you could take us through uh, that multimedia Yeah, absolutely. Okay. okay, so let's, let, let's, let's go to that. Okay, should we go? Okay, so, uh, so what we're seeing here is, uh, is Quake 3 running on the Raspberry Pi. This is running at uh, 1080 uh, to 19, 1900 by 1080. Uh, I certainly remember spending $500 on a, on a graphics card that, uh, that couldn't render this at this kind of, at this kind of resolution. Um, and you can see, okay, we get a little bit of slowdown occasionally, but all the way through this, it's, this is a really nice playable frame rate. Um, so this is just an example of one of the multimedia, uh, one of the kind of the strengths of this platform in multimedia. And we think this is really quite important for our educational, um, for our educational mission. It's important for two reasons. One is that the, uh, the kind of the 8-bit computers of the 1980s that certainly suckered me into, uh, into, uh, into developing, into becoming a software engineer. Um, people bought them in order to play games on. People bought them for a reason which was not simply to, to be a computer pl programming platform. So having these, these kind of you know, decent, uh, a decent amount of graphics performance, this is much better than a, a Nintendo Wii. You know, this is a $25 platform which has much more 3D performance than a Nintendo Wii. Evan, fantastic. Thank you very much for taking the time to do this demo for us and the best of luck for the Raspberry Pi. Yeah, well thank you very much. And we'll see you next time on Chip Estimate TV.